In this tutorial, you're going to learn how to install Magic Zoom into Coffee Cup Visual Site Designer. Magic Zoom will zoom an image on hover, and you can also use these instructions to install Magic Zoom Plus, which zooms on hover and enlarges on click, or Magic Thumb, which enlarges on click, or you could use Magic Magnify Plus, which magnifies on hover and enlarges on click, or we could use Magic Magnify, which simply magnifies on hover. So let's go back to Magic Zoom and download the free trial. That will come down to our desktop. So let's locate that folder where it is, and we're going to unzip the file. You can use any unzipping program, uh, such as WinZip or IsArc. And here is the Magic Zoom folder inside the trial. The Magic Zoom folder is the important folder that we need, and we're just going to copy that into our Coffee Cup website. OK, that's there now. So in our site, we've got an index page, the Magic Zoom folder with the JavaScript CSS files and a couple of graphics. And we've got a couple of images here, a small one and a big one, so we can create our zoom. Right, let's go into Coffee Cup. And we're going to open our website. Here's our page. Now to create a zoom, we're going to hit the Add HTML button over on the left. And we're going to put it just here with a click. Now, in the body HTML, we need to copy some code from the Magic Zoom website. So go to the integration page and scroll down. And just here, you will see the line of code which references the image and the link. So our images are called chair hyphen small and chair hyphen big. So we'll just change that. Good, and there's a class for Magic Zoom. The other thing we need to do is put some code into the head of your page. So go back to the integration page and copy this code and paste that into the header.html tag tab. And we're going to yeah we don't need to change we don't need to change this because it's in the Magic Zoom folder which is where we saved our files so OK that and this dialog box tells you that you should add the files to your site the images so we're going to do that add files here they are the two chairs and OK that and we are we have finished so let's save that and publish it that's finished publishing so we'll view it and there is our zoom now you might like to customize magic zoom for example what we could do is make this this zoom window on the right a little bit bigger it's currently 300 pixels by default but if we go to the integration page again and scroll down under section 2 here, size, we can set a rel tag with a new zoom width of 400 and a height of 400. So let's copy that. Just click onto the HTML there and just after the class of Magic Zoom, we're going to put the rel tag. OK that and publish and you will see an, a larger zoom. So let's view the website, hover over it and the zoom window to the right is now bigger. There are lots of customizations you can make to Magic Zoom to make it just how you want it and they're all explained on this integration page. Here's a popular one, the inner zoom multiple images is, is another popular one, switching between them. And all the code that you need to use is on this page and it's explained. 
Let's have a look at one more. You can change the, the hint, which is the text that shows in the corner of the image. You can add a title, which is uh, just above the image there. And you can add a, add a fade in and a fade out. That's a, a long fade in and a long fade out. So there you have it. That's how to install Magic Zoom into Coffee Cup Visual Site Designer.